Understanding, Protect One's Own, a guide for English learners. Hello, everyone. Welcome to our English language learning series. Today, we're going to explore the phrase, protect one's own. This is a common expression in English, but it can be a bit confusing for those learning the language. So, let's dive in and understand what it really means and how it's used in everyday conversation. Protect one's own is a phrase that means to look after or defend those who are close to you, such as family members, friends, or even colleagues. This phrase emphasizes a sense of responsibility and care towards one's inner circle. It's often used in contexts where someone is taking action to ensure the safety, well-being, or interests of people they are closely connected to. To help you understand better, let's look at some examples of how protect one's own can be used in everyday language. As a father, he always feels it's his duty to protect his own. During the crisis, the community leaders came together to protect their own. In tough times, it's natural for people to want to protect their own interests. These examples show that the phrase can be used in various contexts relating to physical protection, emotional support, or even defending someone's rights or interests. It's important to understand that protect one's own can also have cultural implications. In many cultures, this phrase reflects a deep-rooted value of family loyalty and community support. However, it's also worth noting that in some contexts, the phrase might be used negatively, implying a disregard for others outside one's group. Additionally, there are variations of this phrase like, look after one's own, or take care of one's own, which carry a similar meaning but may be less focused on the aspect of protection and more on general care or support. We hope this video has helped you understand the phrase, protect one's own, Remember, language is not just about words, but also about the context and culture in which it is used. Keep practicing and exploring, and you'll continue to improve your English skills. Thanks for watching, and see you in our next lesson.